Good morning, everybody. Welcome back. Today is so exciting because I'm finally getting my dog. I feel like I've been waiting months for this and we are finally gonna go get her. I'm also moving back today. So I've been in Ottawa for about two months and today's the day I'm moving back. So I'm kind of sad about that, but happy about getting the dog. And let's do a mini interview with my sister to see how she's feeling. Hi. Are you excited? Yeah. So we have to drive like an hour to go get her. And then we're gonna pick up my mom and drive to Montreal. Blue dog. <laughs> Wait, do they know the name? Not yet. Do you want to announce it? No, I think we'll tell you later. We'll tell the name later when we actually get her in the car. Okay, see you in the car. Two hours. Two hours. from the breeder's house and we're late. So because of COVID, everybody has an assigned time slot so that not everybody arrives at the same time and you pick up your puppy. Um, but we're late, we're very late. Am I turning here? Yes, you are. Go straight. Diesel's 105 here, I paid 113. Now what? Now what? Go straight for three kilometers. Here's Argyle. Hi, Argyle. Okay, how's everyone feeling? Yeah, me too. And bumpy car does not help it. Yeah. I'm nervous, but I'm excited. Like, it, until this moment, or until like five minutes ago, I didn't quite feel excited, because it didn't really feel real. We had such a long drive. Yeah. But now it's starting to feel real. And in, in 10 minutes, I'm gonna hold my donkey. Okay, <sighs> but I think the next time, well, the next time you see, we'll be at the breeder. So, let's go. Okay. okay, I just signed this the papers. We're this here. is the moment. Oh my god, there she is! Oh, she's in the in there. She's holding her. Oh my god. This is. Oh no. Oh my god. 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 Oh my Oh she's beautiful. Well, she's not. <laughs> said she's really calm but like she's calm right now but she actually is super high energy so <laughs> we'll see that come out later probably maybe tomorrow <gasps> oh and there's dog hair on me the start of 15 years of dog hair on me that's okay you're worth it you're worth it 
So now we just begin the long drive home because we have to go back to Ottawa to get um, all of my stuff. And then we have to head to Montreal where we live with Maggie and Maggie's new home to get her all set up and settled. So we're just gonna drive back. I'll catch up with you guys later. Like to chew the sake? <laughs> Ouchie! No, no biting. You're so beautiful. What a gorgeous little pup you are. I think she's settling in pretty nice, eh? Wow, I think she's fine. Oh, I think she's gonna be just fine. Where is this thing though? Okay, we're home now. I just put on my blue light glasses just for fun. We're gonna. Oh! <laughs> oh! We're gonna set up Maggie's, this is the playpen, so we're gonna set it up now. Yeah. So that's pretty good. Okay, this is the final playpen result. We just did it in a square. We put her bed and a toy inside. And then we're gonna put some towels in there as well. Me and you. 
Okay, so we are home. We're getting settled in with Maggie. Um, we got a good food delivery for the week because my mom's staying with me for the week, so I need to unpack this. But otherwise, we're just gonna enjoy our first night with Maggie. I haven't been home in two months, like I've said, so I'm kind of like disoriented. I just wanna like straighten up, get cozy. I might dye my hair pink because I'm sick of this blonde. I don't know, that's what we're gonna get up to, but I'm gonna stop filming for now and I'll update you guys tomorrow on how the first night with her goes. It's an obsession that is much too strong. Good morning everyone. We just had our first night with Maggie. I'm sitting on the couch with my mom and Maggie's here eating a little chew toy. She's being really cute, but since last night she was crying so much. At first I put her in her crate and I just lay down next to her and she fell asleep and I was like, okay, perfect. She's gonna sleep through the night. I was like, I nailed this, this is easy, no problem. No. Like I think an hour later she started crying and pretty much every hour she woke up and was crying and she wouldn't go back to sleep unless I like lay down in front of her. And so what I would do is I would stick my hand in the crate, wait till she like settled down and fell asleep, and take my hand out, wait to make sure she doesn't wake up. And then I'd stay just in front for a bit and then I would go back in my bed. But I'm really tired, it was really hard to sleep. Um, and even when she's in her playpen, now she cries. So. <laughs> I think it's gonna be a long day, but it's okay. We love her and now she's being cute eating on her little stick So we'll see how the day goes. The house is a mess But yeah, I'm just happy to be home and happy to be with Maggie now She ate it all? Yeah. Oh, good girl. Oh, now she's coming for the book Well, she has her zebra, but she doesn't like it. Yeah, it's too big maybe Almost need like some balls that she we can toss and she goes, ah, ah, ah. There's a ball in her other bag. Oh, she wants a slipper again. Okay, so Maggie is just taking a nap with my mom. I've decided to dye my hair, well, just the front pieces because I'm kind of getting sick of the blonde. So I've been using this Manic Panic to just dye the front pieces pink. It's super easy to use and it just washes out so I just touch it up but I just like the pink. I feel like it's more fun and I just feel like doing it now because you guys know like when you've spent a bunch of time away from home and then you kind of just start to feel like yucky like you're like oh I just want to like do all of my home stuff like exfoliate and maybe self tan like those are all these things that like I haven't done in a while and they're things that make me feel really good so yeah that's kind of how I'm feeling but obviously I'm just super like distracted and in love with my dog um it's crazy like normally you guys know I'm like a very anxious person and I'm always like thinking and I find with her I'm just thinking about her and I'm just kind of like more present um that was my mom that pointed that out because I was like you know what my I just my anxiety is like gone right now and she's like yeah you're just you're just in the moment you're just present so that's really nice and that's you know 
something I knew kind of would happen. Like a lot of people say that that happens with dogs is they do make you more present. They do help with anxiety and everything. So I'm very happy about that. Um, and yeah, obviously I'm just, you know, tired and um, <clears throat> I'm tired and I'm tired. <laughs> um, but I'm excited. Like this is going to be a fun day and a fun week and a fun lifetime with Maggie. So I don't really know what we're going to get up to the rest of the day, but I mean, for the most part, we're just going to be playing with Maggie, maybe starting some training with her. Um, but all of that, like all of the training and stuff is going to be on her YouTube channel. So if you're into dogs, <laughs> make sure you subscribe to her channel there because we're going to do like doggy vlogs and like training and just more of the documenting of my life with her specifically there. So I think I'm going to wrap up this weekend vlog here. But thank you so much for watching. This was such a fun video um, to make. Something I'm so happy about. I'm so thankful for you guys for coming along with me. And I love you guys so much and I'll talk to you later. Bye. For the